Well, welcome to Crown for the Australian Racehorse of the Year and Hall of Fame Awards. Tonight we honour the champions of the turf and that champion was Typhoon Tracy. She was named Australian Racehorse of the Year and the champion middle distance performer. Very gratifying, you know, but, you know, full honours to the horse. Uh, like I stated up there earlier, she makes my job very easy, this mare. She's a very easy filly to train and uh, she's just a pleasure to have around the stable. We don't see too much emotion from you in that sense, but sensed up there that, that this really meant something to you. Oh, yeah, listen, it's it's another thing off the bucket list, you know. I was fortunate enough to win the Premiership, as you know, and the, and to train a horse of the year, I think that's, uh, you know, that, that's, that's a great feat, you know, and it's up there certainly with the highlights of my career. Well, Star Spangled Banner finished second in the Australian Race Horse of the Year race, but did go away with two titles. They were the Champion Sprinter Award and the Champion Australian Bred International. To come here tonight and, and win the award, just a bit of icing on the cake, you know, so the story lives on and uh, hopefully we can find another one in the next few years. He's, he's all guts, the horse, um, and Leon did a great job training all the way through and he was spot on. Every time Leon said, look, he win, and, and he did, so it was great. Bart Cummings is recuperating in hospital and couldn't be here tonight, but Connections were here to accept three awards on behalf of the stable champion, Group 1 trainer, and Bart's team of So You Think and Fate Perfume made a clean sweep of the three-year-old awards. And to have the three-year-old categories in Philly and Colt, you know, we can't do much more. And it was no surprise to see the Melbourne Cup winner, shocking, named the champion stayer. Last year we won the uh, best three-year-old with uh, Hubie and, and now Shocking's won the best stayer award and, uh, you know, it's an absolute privilege to uh, get an award like that. And the champion Group 1 jockey for the second consecutive year was the Sydney-based Nash Rewilla. Last year I had six Group 1 wins and, you know, probably looking back now, I, I probably didn't think I'd be able to achieve what I have this year um, going forward, you know. Um, at the time I thought it was an amazing year, so, uh, you know, to come out and get the opportunity to ride nine, nine minutes this, this season, you know, it's just been amazing and you, you, you've sort of got to be lucky enough to get the right rides and um, fortunately I've, you know, got the opportunities and I think I think everyone that's given them to me. And in the other awards tonight, Crystal Lilly was named the champion two-year-old in Australia. Black and Bent the champion jumper. Reduce Choice the champion sire. They were the Australian Racehorse of the Year awards. All honours going to Typhoon Tracy.